Everybody has sex. Not me. Say <laughs> <laughs> When you come to a sex shop, don't deep throw the dildo. No kissy, no touchy touchy. Save that for tonight. Spank each other. Not around us, because we didn't give you consent and we don't want to see it. People should act like an adult in an adult store. Save the shenanigans for your home. We love you. We love the fact that you want to buy all this stuff and that you're so excited to try it. But try it at home. Can I tell you a little story? A lot of them, they just straight out. One of those things is for my girlfriend, the other one is for my mistress. Which one should I decide? So that's your prerogative. You buy the one that you like the best. We don't push sales. Okay. We don't. <laughs> what about that guy who used his wife's card to buy his girlfriend something? Wow, sad on bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> My favorite story so far is of a person who came in and purchased lube, which I was so excited for because it's one of those things that people gloss over. Um, however, they also asked to use the bathroom and knocked on the door and heard noises that I was not prepared to hear. It's just really awkward after that. So just don't masturbate in public bathrooms, please. We'll miss you. People used to go to the bathroom and then we would be missing, you know, displays of butt mm -hmm. plugs, like hiding toys in their bodies and then leaving and walking out of the store. Like A plus for effort, I guess, but uh, <laughs> F minus on the fact that it's a display toy. I don't want to shame anybody, but everybody in New York touches our toys. You're gonna want a clean one before you do that anyway. And lubricant, I'm sure they didn't do it with lube. Everybody is different, everybody's body is different, so it's good to go to stores because you can get educated, you can see and feel things. It's different from looking online because it could look like it's this small and then in person it's like so big. Pro tip, testing the vibrators on your nose will be similar to the nerve sensitivity of like your other bits. Don't feel ashamed, nobody's gonna judge you. And even if there's customers in there, they're in there too, so they're not gonna judge you because they're in there too. Just feel like calm and ease, like, we're here for you. What do you want to buy? We have the best toys you anybody can dream from. Little ones, big ones, you go through that door and you're going to paradise. You get oh. Folks come in and try to purchase services other than the education of sex toys. Do not ask if we have the toys, mm -hmm. if we use the toys. Mm -hmm. It'd be kind of silly if we worked in a sex shop and didn't have any toys for many, many reasons. You know, we all gotta benefit somehow. You know, ask questions respectfully. Don't ask me what my favorite thing is, because I guarantee we're not on the same wavelength. Mm -hmm. We may know that you are looking for a butt plug, but I don't know your last name, so let's keep it there. <laughs> We're here to sell you things, help us out, help you find out what you want, because we just met you.